Hey everybody, it's Amy from Muzzo Media Productions and we are going live with Studio B at the Audubon Center. So come with me, we're doing our birds exhibit tonight. We're excited to be here. Let me show you around the center. John James Audubon Visitor Center at Mill Grove. And we are walking in to check out the facility. If you've never been, this is an incredible place, thank you, for bird watching. If you're a bird lover or just want to learn more or just want to spend a day, uh, you should come by and take a look. And here is the Audubon Center, which we'll show you really quick first. And then we're going to show you our art exhibit. Studio B is excited to be partnering with the Audubon Center when we featured our birds exhibit in Boyertown. They came on up and checked it out and they were so impressed with our little exhibit that they said, you need to really partner with us. So we're looking forward to partnering with them maybe for future things. Um, but you can see that the Audubon Center, it has a lot of educational opportunities um, for all ages and they have interactive displays, as you can see here. And you can learn all about birds. So we're just taking a really quick tour here. There's so much to see. You can't possibly see it all in a short live video. And we wanna to get to the art because that's what we're here for tonight. But this place is just really cool. You can see there's a lot of art on the wall already featuring all the different birds. It's just a beautiful facility. If you're joining us on the live, say hello. Let us know where you're connecting from. If you have any questions or you want to see anything a little closer, let me know. Drop me a comment. All right. There's some more displays here. This is just an incredible place. Fun for the family. And this is talking about extinction and habitat loss. Um, here are some interactive games for the kids, although there is no age limit. Pretty cool. And there's some interactive displays here, again, with whatever you want to learn about. They have videos playing. Conservation information. This is pretty cool. This is uh, talking about bird feathers flight feathers, wing feathers, different feathers and what their function is. And then here are some different nests. Some different nests here. Let's go around to the front so we can see the labels because that's kind of cool. Okay. And there's the different nests. different eggs pretty cool all right we're moving along we're here at the Audubon Center we're gonna be featuring our Studio B arts exhibit very soon we're just taking a quick walk through the facility first just because it's a cool place to see if you've never been here and this is really neat you can press the button and you can hear the bird calls so that's fun I'm a bit of a bird nerd myself, so I could spend hours here, but I'm not going to do that because we're here to see the arts exhibit. So we're gonna keep moving, but just to give you an idea of how big this place is and how many educational opportunities there are, I had to walk you through. And this is just the front room. They also have um, the grounds here, which they have plantings that encourage diversity of bird species so you can see um, you can just spend some time here and see all the different birds too and that's just um, just incredible from an education standpoint and of course here is our the Audubon gift shop here which you can get all kinds of bird gifts that you care to uh, purchase for anyone all right we're gonna go take a look at the art so let's walk down here yes. Yes. We'll check out the art. Say hi to 
Sue and Jane, who are down there doing their thing in the exhibit room. If you're joining us live, thanks for tuning in. We're about to go into the exhibit area for the birds exhibit with Studio B. Here we are. Between uh, Jane and Sue, they know just about everybody that's coming in the door tonight, which is awesome. We've got some people coming from local Boyer Town, and we've also got people coming from Audubon area. So we're gonna go in and see if we can find Sue, and we'll catch up to Jane in just a little bit. So here's our sign for the birds exhibit from Studio B. And we're so excited to be partnering with Audubon to have our display featured. We're gonna take a walk through. Some of you may remember when we did the first live on this exhibit and we went through and we talked about some of the art. So I'm just gonna do a walk through here, but certainly if you see something familiar or you see something you like, you can drop me a comment or you can ask me a question and I can focus in on it a little more closely. There we go. It's interesting to see the exhibit in a different space. It looks so much different in this space than it did in our small but mighty studio in Boyertown. So here you can see some of the pieces. It's almost like having another brand new show. And here's some of the art. Again, if you see something that you like or you have questions or comments, please feel free to drop me a comment. And we're just gonna keep walking through and looking at all the different art. Thank you for joining us. Okay, and some of this art might look familiar to you from the Studio B exhibit in Boyertown. We've just got a change of scenery here. I see a lot of bird lovers joining us on our Facebook Live. And this is not part of the exhibit. This is just part of the Audubon Center, but they have art and birds and all kinds of educational props all over this facility. It's really incredible to see. And if you look out, ooh, if you look out the window, uh, you can see there's, there's lots of things outside that are art exhibits too. There's, there's a giant egg out there that I see. And there's a d lot of different bird houses, bat houses, things like that, and just lots of flowers and things that encourage birds to visit here. So, all right, moving along, we've got all this wonderful bird art that we're looking at. And uh, here we are. I see a lot of people joining us. Thanks for joining us. Coming to you live from the Audubon Center partnering with Studio B for their birds exhibit. Such a great partnership. Yeah. All right. And you can see we've got uh, all kinds of educational props here too from the Audubon Center. That's not part of the art exhibit, but it complements it very nicely. So we're just gonna keep on moving along and checking out the artwork. And we're starting to fill up here. We've got a really good crowd coming in, checking out the pieces. Some people are visiting for the first time. So it's a great way to pull people into the Audubon Center. They can stay and visit all of the exhibits tonight, not just the art. And we'll be here till seven, so it's not too late. If you wanna come down, they have a lovely reception set up with some treats, some beverages and you can come in see the art and walk the grounds and see all of the displays in the museum as well so all right we're going to go to the interior because it's pretty crowded out there so we're going to move over to an area that's not so crowded okay and here's some more of our art and i just love to see all the different birds the bird art and then the museum here i am in my glory over here a little bit more if you see something you like and you have questions or you want to make a comment let me know 
Thanks for joining us on our virtual tour. We're just checking out the bird's exhibit in its new habitat. <laughs> Having a reception here at Audubon. It's nice to see so many people coming out and checking out the art. And it's really interesting to see all the artwork in this new space because it, it's almost like a new show. Turn around and look back. There's so much to see. All right, I'm gonna keep moving, and we're gonna say hello to Sue. Sue's over here talking. She's been talking to uh, and greeting some guests, but now we're gonna catch up to her a little bit because she has been working hard to create this amazing space. So. Uh, let her say a few words about that. Hi, welcome to Birds at Audubon. We're really excited to have people come in here and see our work. If you want to come this way and um, I can point out some things from behind. So the show, <laughs> the show is here. We have 107 pieces. Um, they are show walls and double, both sided. So there's a lot of work. We had originally almost 200 pieces entered into the show, but it was very hard just to move 107 pieces. So several trips, several cars, several people. And so we have a lovely exhibition and um, sounds like we're about to make some sales here. Tonight, we're really excited because they opened their banquet room, which I hadn't seen before. And I know Amy will show it to you, but it's spectacular. And it was a big thing for them to have more people see that, I think. So we're excited to be part of that too. Thank you, Sue. We're going to keep walking. I think there's only one wall left for us to cover. Uh, we're just trying to work around the crowds, and uh, and then we'll uh, we'll come back. All right. Thank you. All right. We're going to keep moving. I want to make sure I show you the whole exhibit, and it's a, there's a lot to see here. If you do see something you like, please drop me a comment. If you have questions, or maybe you're interested in purchasing something, um, the art that's on display tonight. Most of it is for sale, although we do have some sales happening right now. So I guess if you see something that catches your eye, speak up now. All right. There we go. And I'm going through a little bit faster than I normally would just because we've already done this show as a live. But it does look a lot different in this space. Um, and so sometimes when we go through an art exhibit the first time, we miss things. And going through it a second time, maybe something else is going to catch your eye that you might not have caught the first time. So I'm happy to bring this to you and I'm happy to focus in on anything that you find interesting that you want to see more of. All right. And we are here at the opening reception at the Audubon Center until seven o'clock tonight. So it's not too late to come on down and see it for yourself. Seeing it in person is such an amazing experience, especially at this facility, just because the bird theme is so strong in this facility and uh, not just with our art, but definitely complements the art. So I'm gonna keep walking down here and see if I can show you the last few pieces that I didn't catch on the first go round. Okay. So that's about, that's everything. Um, that's everything that we can see at this point. I'm gonna keep walking around the Audubon Center and see if I can show you a little bit more of the center. Um, this is a wonderful facility to bring school groups or bring your family. Um, they also do, they host events here and I'm gonna show you their banquet hall in just a minute, but I wanna say hi to Jane since I caught her at a free moment, which is rare because Jane knows everybody. Hi. hi, Jane. Hi, Amy. Thank you so much for doing this for us. <laughs> we just walked through, it's an amazing Did, exhibit. Isn't it an amazing exhibit? Yep. Did you get into the museum at all? We walked through. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and wonderful. We're walk through the reception. It's a beautiful space. Mm -hmm. Yes. Really and good. there's some good healthy looking snacks in there too. Oh good. Along All right. with an adult beverage or so. <laughs> <laughs> wonderful.
We'll circle back in a few minutes. That sounds great. Okay. Take care, Amy. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right, we're going to keep walking and check out this banquet hall. I haven't been here before either, so I'm just going to follow the sounds of uh, people having fun, and I'm guessing this is the banquet hall. And it does look like a, a very nice space to host an event. So I'm going to give you the, the 360 here. It's a really, really nice venue that I didn't even know was here. And I'm guessing a lot of people don't know it's here. So I'm happy to showcase it so people will know. So the space itself is really nice, but then outside the windows is really nice as well. They have um, gardens and uh, a lot of native plants and obviously a lot of bird watching stations. And um, there are a lot of other buildings on this property that you can tour um, but given the focus of our time is on the art today I'm just going to focus on what's immediately around us um, but this is a beautiful venue space it looks like there's some outdoor space as well um, so you can see they have some fire pits um, some fire pits out there and they have um, some activities for the family out there and of course they have a very nice spread laid out for the participants of the art reception tonight let's see if i can get you a better look out that window so you can see there's all kinds of stuff out there as well for um, if you have a group here so okay we're going to keep going we're going to circle back to the art gallery and um, give you one final chance to ask questions. Uh, oh wait, first we have to step over and see there's a friend over here. Um, there's a little feathered friend over here. So let's see who we have here. Oh, look at this little guy. Hi, how are you? Okay. This is Abby. She's an Eastern Screech Owl. Okay. The last time we did a live with Audubon, we met Scooter, and I understand he's not with us now. So we have Abby. What a precious little creature. Okay. So she's a Red Morph Eastern Screech Owl. Okay. Beautiful. Um, all the way from West Virginia. She was uh, from a, a wildlife rehab. Okay. So she was actually uh, struck by a car. Struck by a car, okay. I don't know if you can see on there, but she does have some scar tissue over her one eye. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know if you can see on the camera. I can see where I'm standing, but it's hard to know what gets picked up on the camera. But, uh, well, thank you for the good work that you do here. Yeah, we're just doing a, a nice Studio B, the art gallery. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we're just doing a, a live for the people who can't attend so that they know what's here at the Audubon Center and uh, just showing them the facility and the, the museum area and all that. So, yeah. Thank you. Okay. All right, we're going to go back to the art area and see if anybody has any comments or questions, I'd be glad to um, go back and focus on any of the art you're interested in. Otherwise, we will probably be wrapping up the virtual tour, um, but I'm gonna go back to the museum. So if there's anything anybody wants to see, drop me a comment and let me know, and I'd be glad to focus in on it. And you can also reach out to us on Studio BBB org if you want to uh, learn more about Studio B or you can learn more about the Audubon Center at audubon.org all right so we're back in the gallery again I'm, I went through already one time but if you've joined us late and there's anything in particular that you're interested in seeing I'd be glad to go back through and focus on it otherwise we are going to end our live for the evening well maybe we'll do another one in a little while I don't know okay well thanks everyone for joining us thanks for supporting Studio B and be sure to come down here and check out the Audubon Center it is amazing we'll be here till 7 tonight if you want to come check out the art in person thanks so much bye